Now, basically, as you know, the, the all sentient, all sentient being, and particularly human being, is by innate way, uh, by nature, you see, we have desire. Uh, we have a desire that simply we want to be a happy person, a happy being. And we do not want pains and sufferings. So that is basis. That's, I think, basic factor. And then, on that basis, you see, we also have the, every right to be happy being, a happy person. And we have every right, you see, to, uh, I said, to use, you see, different methods or different means to overcome suffering and to achieve more happier life. I think provided that that method should not um, expense on others' right or should not create you see, the uh, suffering, more suffering on other, then in such case, you see, they, it is uh, worthwhile is it, to think seriously, is it, to judge seriously, you see, the uh, positive consequences and the negative consequences, which is, you see, the uh, greater. Then, you see, under, under that analyze, you see, we have to adopt, you see, uh, you see, this method is right, this method is not right. And also, you see, there is the consequences, uh, there are, you see, the, uh, implication or differences, short-term interest and long-term interest. So sometimes, you see, there is conflict, short-term interest and long-term interest. So in such case, the long-term interest is more important than the short-term. <clears throat> so Buddhists usually you see, explain there is no absolute. Things are relative. So we have to judge on the circumstances according to circumstances. <clears throat> now, now the, our experiences or feeling, which something is mainly related with body and mind. You see, within two, they got, we can, I mean, we can, uh, well, you can understand that through our daily, ex daily experience, the mental suffering or mental happiness is superior than the physical. Again, quite clear. Uh, you see, two persons you see, facing the same kind of you see, the tragedy, and one person, because, due to you see, mental, mental attitude, one person you see, may face that, trage that tragedy a bit easily, Another more difficult. So these, uh, you see, we clearly you see, they, uh, see you see, these things. And then also, the in, in material, or say the uh, rather, or say the world or the society where uh, more advanced material development. Uh, in in such a society. There are also, you see, the equally, you see, a lot of mental unrest, mental frustrations also. If not worse, there is equally, you see, a lot of problems there. So this also, you see, shows us the, uh, we, after all, we are human beings. We are not mission protect. You see, this body is something different than a, just, you see, pure, how to say, the mechanic thing. So therefore, the, uh, if, we, uh, if we consider or if we believe is that all human problem can be solved by machine or by matter, that attitude I think is wrong. You see, the, of course, material benefit or material facility is extremely useful. Uh, at the same time, the, it is quite nature. The, all our problem cannot solve by matter, my, I say the material uh, facilities alone. So therefore, the, uh, we have to we have to take I say, seriously 
about our own, as in the inner ability, deeper value. Mm, so the, I always believe the for, for how to say, each individual human being, if you see someone who really wants to be a happy life, then it is very, very important to pursue both the external, ex, the external means and internal means. So in other words, material development, material facility, and internal mental facility or mental how to say, the, uh, develop, development. Or in other words, we can say spiritual. But here, when, when I say spiritual, not necessarily religious faith, any kind of religious faith. When I say it's a spirit, mental spiritual is the basic human good quality, such as human affection, and sense of involvement. So I think this, this and the human intelligence. Intelligence is properly guided by uh, the, uh, good motivation and human honesty, discipline, these are, I think, the basic human good quality. So this from birth, we have all these things, not come, not come later. Religious faith come later. And in fact, I believe, this is the various different religious, you see, they, I think they're teaching. Uh, there are two levels, there's one level, you see, they talk about uh, such as, as God or Almighty, these things, and for Buddhist, you see, Nirvana, next life, you see, these things. That is, is a, another, is a different level. Another, what say? One level. And so, one level, the all religious, you see, teaching or tradition, you see, they teach us to be a good human being, warm hearted person. So, this actually, this simply is strengthening basic human good quality, which we have from birth. So, so the, uh, you see, when I talk about the uh, spiritual means, you see, the, this is a basic human good quality. 